Rope Chains is popping right now. Just like the Cubans, I think the strong second would be a rope chain, whether it's reminiscent of the Black Boy, the old school rappers with the dookie ropes with the big pendants on it. They're hitting and they're hitting hard. And now people like Daniel Jewelry Inc. are doing customizations to them where they're adding diamonds, making custom locks. So let me show y'all some beautiful rope chains that you can get from Daniel Jewelry Inc. Hosted by none other than the Dawn. Kind of a big deal. Bless the morning, my beautiful peoples. You know who it is. This is your boy, C3U to the B to the A. I ain't gonna make it too complicated, but I'm gonna show you a dope, and I mean dope variety on neck and in hand of different millimeter rope chains, starting from seven millimeters all the way down to two, maybe 1.5 millimeters. So let's get right into the bullshit because I know y'all don't like to hear me talk a lot. So let's just show more than talk. We're gonna start from seven down. So the first chain is a seven millimeter 14 karat gold 26 inch rope with the lobster clasp. Look at the shine on this shit. That's one of the things about the rope chains. The way that it's designed, it just bounces light right off all the edges. And it really doesn't matter. Even with the most dimmest lighting, you can still get some flex and beautiful shine off of it. I feel like people generally wear rope chains for a subtle flex and more of everyday use. And this one, when you go seven millimeter, you're looking for a flex for real. Let me show you what it looked like on body. Boom. So that's what the seven millimeter, 26 inch look like. Beautiful length, I'm a 24, 26 guy, never more than 26. I think 26 might be perfect. I go hard for 24 inch, but 26 with no pendant, I think might be right on point. I'm gonna show you a little bit of close up. Without showing you too much of my man tits, you can wear this shit out, you can wear it in, you still get a little bit of a nice neck profile right there. When they don't wanna be too flashy or ostentatious and wear the chains out, they wanna know what that neck profile look like. Not everybody's gonna show you the neck profile here. Neck profile. Don't worry about my shape of my beard, it looks a little ratchet, but you know, this is the type of shit that you get with this channel. So you seven millimeter, 14 karat gold, 26 inch. Let's go down to six. Now the dope shit is I got two varieties of six and none of them have lobster class. One is a fully iced out barrel lock and one is a solid barrel lock on a rope chain. These are both six millimeter, 26 inch. They're both six millimeter, one's 25 and the other one's 26 inch. So let me show you them side by side. And again, they're pretty much the exact same chain. I know the lighting looks a little crazy sometimes, you know, work with me, I'm working with what I can. But these are beautiful chains. Six millimeter is actually a very, very nice size. Again, not a popular size. Personally, from what I've seen, people are usually under five millimeter with these joints. But I'll show you what both of them look like on. Don't mind my hair, look at that mess that I have on top of my head. It looks like a fucking bird nest. See, if you got that kind of paper to double stack them, that shit just look kind of crazy. I'll show you the close up. Nobody shows you that neck profile like I do. One's 25, one's 26. See, as they're super close together, but even a 25, 26, 25 isn't one I even knew that was existed because that's kind of customization. Now people generally put them on their inventory, but you ask for a 25 and I'm sure they'll just do it, obviously. Let's go to five millimeter, shall we? Now this one's a 14 karat gold five millimeter joint. This is usually where I see people starting at. Even with this lighting situation, you can still see the flex of light bouncing off these ropes. That's one of the things about these appeal of these rope chains, man. They're just beautiful. They're timeless pieces. We've seen that they come back. This is a 24 inch, so some 24s I could put over my head, some I don't. I'm not gonna try it, but look, 24 is also a sick size. This is a more conservative size. A comfortable, perfect length size along with 26. 26 has a little bit of slack. 24 is like perfect. Still has that nice neck profile. This is a comfortable chain to be wearing with a button up, you know, with the buttons all open and this shit just laying on the better hair like Chuck Norris. That's perfectly fine. Just simple, sexy, elegant. You can't go wrong with a rope, man. Next one. Now this size is definitely way more common and I think actually this might be more of a recommended size for a daily use. This is a four millimeter, 14 karat gold, 28 inch. This is a little too long for my taste, but to each his own. Still beautiful, still has a great size. Again, the same shine. I'm showing you shit over and over just so you can get a perspective. Great craftsmanship, solid, sturdy, doesn't feel flimsy. You could pull this shit apart as you can see. If I break it, I buy it. And I can actually put this shit over my head with the fucking hat. That's how big this joint is. This shit is for me. For me, this is too long, but I'm also a short dude. So if you have a long torso, this might be perfect for you. You can put a pendant on this shit. You know what I'm saying? That shit will probably hang down to your dick. But for some people, this might work. I'll show you the close up.
nothing too flashy, not too heavy, can roll around all day and it just doesn't lose, it just doesn't coil up or kink or just turn over. You could just mess with this shit all day and it just goes back to its normal style. Ropes is hitting. Next one. Now we got another 14 karat gold 28 inch three millimeter rope. Definitely a bit smaller, but still not feminine. Definitely versatile. Again, for a daily wear, it's not a bad chain. Even when you put it over your head. Three millimeters still looks beautiful, just chilling on the chest, just low key. They do look a little bit larger in camera. Keep that in mind. Everything in camera is, you know, 10 pounds over. Me, I'm really like 120 pounds and six foot seven rip with a complete six pack, but the camera doesn't reflect that. Real dope, up close. everyday wear beautiful sizing and definitely more affordable now i definitely got more affordable joints that i didn't even know they had that are available on the website and i'm going to show you them in a bundle now these are a bundle of two millimeter 10 carat rope chains you don't always have to go for the 14 carat route i am a fan of 14 carat that's my personal preference i can't really afford the 18 carat as of yet now 14 carat for an everyday use good investment quality just durability is perfect for me 10 carat it has less gold content more alloy so it is durable actually maybe more durable than 14 carat gold but it's still gold and these are two millimeters that are on the website and definitely way more affordable than i could have imagined so these are the bundles two millimeter rope chains look at the size of these joints i'll separate them so they don't all look crazy huge but this is what a two millimeter looks like you know what i'm saying compare it to like a nail don't judge my non-manicure this is so you can get a perspective two millimeters are not huge but if you want to go for the lightweight more cost effective, or you want to kind of spread your money differently and get a couple of these shits and just stack them, you might be a go. I'll show you what a couple of them look like stacked. So maybe if you don't want to go the 14 route bigger, you can go a bunch of small ones. Your choice. So again, here's a close up of the two millimeter by itself. Now I'm, this one's about, this one looks like it's about a 22 inch. Well, oh, maybe less. No, this might be like a 20 inch. This might look like a choker on me. I might look super wild. Whoa, yeah, this is definitely like 20 to 18 inch. This is a short hot pocket right here. Ooh wee, I would never wear this, but this is me personally. Some of the young cats would like this shit, that choker look. Mm, this is not my flow. But maybe if you stack them together, it gives it a little profile, a little thickness. Again, I wouldn't personally wear this, but just giving you a perspective. Hey, I got some longer ones for you. I'll leave these two little shorties on here just so you could get an idea. Now we talking. Now we talking with some 24s here. All right, here we go. It's getting nervous wearing these short joints, but look, you can layer these shits. Again, they're 10 karat gold, so they're gonna be a lot more cost effective than the other ones. And if you go for that layered look, there you go. So you can see up close. It's all a matter of perspective. It's all a matter of your budget, perspective, flex appeal, or subtle. Damn, this shit is short. Now I'm gonna show you all of them side by side, counting down from seven to two. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. That's my education on rope chains. If you wanna get some bigger joints than this, you better have deep pockets because these shits are not cheap. Remember, these are solid. These are not hollow. These aren't empty. These, you can't blow into them and hear the fucking echo. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart. And I'll see y'all bitches next time. Let me know what other chains you guys wanna see. Do you wanna see some Hermes link? Do you wanna see any other different types of Cubans? Do you wanna see some crazy expensive shit? Maybe I could put it on my credit card and have a return policy. I'll see y'all motherfuckers next time. You know who it is? It's the biggest chain influencer in the game, AKA the Cuban King. What's fresh? Who's best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who I am? With a fly gun, hold a money folder, hold a roller, star tag when it's time to call back. For the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey, for all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse suite on top of my mom's crib. Man. It's long since you never get in. It's long since that you would think that you would. <laughs>